There comes a time when the stork is no longer a good enough answer for the question, where do babies come from? Pregnancy is a 40-week process, and interestingly enough, the first two weeks you aren't even actually pregnant. The first week of your pregnancy, you are going through your menstrual cycle. During your menstrual cycle, your body is forming a mature oocyte, or in other words, an egg. Ovulation is when your body releases a mature egg into the fallopian tubes. If you have a regular 28-day cycle, this will be around the second week. This is when you are most likely to conceive. If you have unprotected sex during this time, you can become pregnant. With the action of intercourse, your partner will ejaculate millions of mature spermatozoas, otherwise known as sperm, into your vagina. Hundreds of them will then make it to your fallopian tubes. Once the sperm meet up with your mature egg, otherwise known as the ovum, one of them will penetrate the egg and will be crowned the victor. We now have what we call a zygote. This process is what we call conception. This single cell zygote, which contains the diploid number of chromosomes, now goes into the mitotic cell division. In three days after cell fertilization, the zygote forms a 16-cell solid sphere called the morua. Mitosis now continues for five more days, and the morula becomes hollow and fills with fluid and is now known as a blastocyst. Your blastocyst contains a full set of DNA, which determines sex, eye color, and other traits that you aren't able to predict yet. Near the end of week three, the blastocyst will attach itself to the endometrium, the lining of the uterus, and this is what we call implantation.